There you go. There's the tail fibers. Giveaway for baddie tie flies. They have a little bump here where people try to save materials. And now we can tie down the rest of the material. Becoming a lot stronger and easier to deal with. Pull the thread tight. And as it pulls tight, let the hair slide out of your fingers. Make another wrap in exactly the same thing. The simplest is to use a half hitch. Make a half hitch around a tool like this or an old pen your fingers in the thread and get that triangle. This is essential. The base of the triangle must be free floating. If you accident and providing it with a little bit more durability and tie the hurl off. It's a matter of personal preference. If you're tying flies for fast water you would and there you have it. Gold ribbed here's your nymph. That's how you do it and we're going to tie a full parachute post pattern or two later on but that's the basic technique there it is the parachute spider frequently referred to locally as the parachute RAB and there is the finished rat face McDougal this is a mallard which are really far too large you'll see to create a little bit of trout size manipulation you get a very similar effect Maybe not quite as good. A fuzzy bug. Doesn't look like anything in particular. It's what I call no heckle, soft heckle. It's an extremely effective pattern to imitate emergers.